Yo, what's good, guys? It's your boy Lost Gray in the building, man. Coming, coming at you guys with a story time, man. I got a juicy story time for you guys, as you can tell by the title. And this story time, I'm gonna be telling you guys how I got beat up by a girl. Literally got beat up by a girl, man. Everybody just calm down. I know a lot of people get us, you know, besides yourself, thinking like, oh, Eli Sacre got beat up by a girl. If he got beat up by a girl, I could beat him up. Let me tell you something. You is not beating me up, all right? I guarantee you that. You feel me? Guarantee you that. Your boy, 6'6", 200 pounds. Not even all about the height or none of that. I just got the hands, period. This is when I was like, nine ten years old you feel me and the only reason why she beat me up was because she was big as hell she was fat y'all i was strong as hell she was fat as hell so it's like she had the advantage over me i couldn't do nothing she was too heavy before we get into this video i just want all you guys to know your boy is officially doing only real content i'm no longer doing creepy content i'm done with that y'all i promise you guys i will never do that content again in my life that is so done. I'm done with that. So now on the channel, you could be expecting nothing but challenges, pranks, vlogs, reactions, mukbangs, social experiments, public pranks, 1v1s, basketball, nothing but organic content on this channel, all that creepy stuff and 3 a.m. this, calling this, hunting for this. That's dead, it's dead. I said I'm done with that content. So yeah, man, everybody smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Hit the post notification bell so you never miss the upload. Go subscribe to my blog channel, link will be in the description. With that being said, let's get into this story time, man. Let's, ah, ah. Let's get into this story time, man. All right, guys, so. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, you put that pinky up. So this all taking place in, I believe it was elementary school. I was in like the third grade. So that means I was like a good nine, eight, nine years old. Elementary school, eight, nine years old. Now I'm not gonna lie y'all, um, some of this stuff is a blur to me. Like I don't remember every single part of it because it happened so long ago. I'm literally 23, this happened when I was eight or nine. So that's like what? That's hella years ago. That's hella years ago. That's like what? 19 years ago? Oh, I'm stupid. Oh, I'm stupid. And nobody get on nobody get on me, man. I'm stupid. Like 16 years ago. years ago I yeah so I boom I'm in elementary school right and there's this girl bro I don't even remember seeing this girl either to be honest with you. no I did see her I did see this girl I remember this girl this is gonna kick me in my nuts yeah 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 I remember her. I remember her but like I said it happened so long ago all I know she was fat she looked like Debo from Friday she looked like that man she just this, this big as hell like a, the bully type you feel me anyway I'm, I'm gonna get straight to the point of what happened I don't really remember like you know like a lot so i'm gonna get straight to what happened anyway y'all so basically in elementary school after school like my last period of class the teachers would take us outside for recess like they would just take us out as we behave they just take us outside for the last period normally we just stay in the um the class all day if we behave then sometimes they would take us outside the last period you feel me so it was one of those days everybody behaved it was a nice day outside the teachers like you know what you guys behaving for the last period, we could go to recess. It was lit, everybody turned up like, hey, hey, hey. You feel me? Now me, I'm the type of kid, like I love playing, you feel me? Like I'm the type of dude when the teacher's like, okay guys, get online, it's time to go. I'm still that one kid that still be running around like I don't hear, I still try to run around. You feel me, do that extra stuff. So anyway, it's time for recess. You feel me, we lining up and all that, I'm feeling good. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm finna go crazy. We get online, you know, we walk to the park. You feel me, we in the park. The teacher's like, all right, guys, everybody, you have like a half hour, go do your thing, have fun, blah, blah, blah. We're like, all right, bet. Stay where we can see you. Don't need a park. We're like, all right, cool. That's obvious common sense. We start doing our thing. We were everybody playing. We chilling, we chilling, we chilling. You feel me? Everything is cool. You know what I'm saying? So, about a half hour go by. That's how long the period was. Teacher, like, everybody, okay, guys, time to line up. Let's go. It's time for busing. I used to take the cheese bus. You feel me? Like, God damn, I had a rough childhood. God damn. 
Your boy used to take the damn cheese bus, man, the school bus. God damn, man, you know damn well, guys. If you're in school, you taking the school bus, you ain't getting no girls, man. They don't think you're in special way. Everybody was thinking I'm in special way. They're like, you take the cheese bus? I take the metro. They was like, I got a metro car. I take the, the city bus. <laughs> you take a school bus. You take the cheese bus. I take the cream cheese. Ah. But now look, I don't take no bus now. Now I'm taking whips now. Now I got a, a, a coupe now. You feel me? Now I'm whipping coupes. Now what you on? Now I got the metro car. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sure I'm whipping the coup. <laughs> but yeah, so anyway, the teacher's telling us to line up. I'm like, no, hell no. You know what I'm saying? I just got out here. You feel me? I feel like, like we just got outside. I'm feeling the vibe. I'm sitting there running. I'm feeling the damn vibe. You know what I'm saying? I'm feeling the wind blowing against my face. I'm chilling with my friends. Living my best life. You know, when I'm home, my mom never really used to let me go outside. Every time I asked her, she'd be like, no, most of the time. She would never let me go outside. You know, I was young and she, like I said, she barely let me go outside. So I'd be in the crib bored. So when I get this opportunity to live my life and run and be free, believe me, I'm gonna do that. You feel me? Anyway, I'm sitting there running. I'm having fun. She's like, line up. I'm like, no, hell no, I'm not lining up right now. You guys know how, like, when it's recess, it seems like recess is always the period that goes by the fastest, bro. Whenever you have that free time, that's when when everything want to go by fast. But when you ain't normal class doing your work, everything want to go slow as hell. Even though we was out there half hour, I felt like I was only out there 10 minutes, and they sitting there, like, come in. I'm like, nah, I'm still playing. So I'm still sitting there running. And the teacher's like, Elijah, come on, get online. It's time for busting. Let's go. But me being hard I'm like, nah, I'm still sitting there running. Like, I don't hear them just playing, you know, swinging on the monkey bars, running on the little bridges. This fat girl started getting tight. She's like, Elijah, let's go. Let's go. And I'm still sitting there, still running. I'm like, well, who's you? Like, shut your ass up. What you gonna do at the end of the day? Your fat ass can't catch me. What you really gonna do at the end of the day? Shut your ass up and watch me. You know what I'm saying? Like, watch me win. You can watch me nay nay. You can watch me run, run, and watch me play, play. My dumb ass, I don't know why I decided to do this, bro. My dumb ass, because basically I was like on the play section. I was like, where you know where the little bridges are, where you go to the playground, the little play area. You walk up a little stage, start running on little bridges. They got the little tic tac toe, the slides. I was up there, and the girl was down there on the ground. So my dumb ass thought, you know what? I'm gonna go down the stairs and I'm gonna try to get to the other side of the park. I want to go to the other side and play on the other play area. Cause the other area I was at was here in trash. I'm like, yo, I'm finna go over there. Dot com. I'm running down the stairs and I thought I was gonna bop this girl. I'm like, you fat, you ain't doing nothing, you feel me? So I tried to bop her. I'm like, whoop. She tackled me, bro. She literally tackled me, bro. She was like on some, on some, on some B shit, bro. She shit hit me with the, you feel me? She hit me with the. I'm like, oh, so I felt like beat, I fell. And I thought I was gonna be it, like she was gonna tackle me, and that was it. I just see Shorty walking towards me, bro. Literally, I just feel the earth like quaking, like the earth quaked a little bit. I feel the ground shaking, like doing, doing, doing. I'm looking up at her like, God So she get on top of me, she start hitting me. Boop, boop, boop. All I remember is my legs just sticking up like this. And I'm, I'm just throwing kicks like this. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm just throwing kicks like that. Trying to kick her off me and it's not doing nothing. It's not even moving her, bro. I'm like, God damn, my legs is the strongest part of my body. You still not moving, guy. I'm trying to hit her back. She, it's not affecting her. I'm like, God damn. She got 100% body armor on. So I couldn't do nothing. I'm sitting there getting beat up. Everybody laughing like, oh, 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 oh. I'm just sitting there like, I was crying. <laughs> I was really crying, bro. <laughs> She's sitting there pounding me like King Kong, like bing, 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 bing. The teachers came. The teachers got her off me. Literally took like three teachers to get her off me. It was Gonzalez, it was Audrey, and some other teacher. Took three of them to get her off of me. She finally got off me. I was just sitting there crying. Like, <laughs> you feel me? So I got on the line, and then we finally walked home. I mean, we walked back to the school for bus and everything. And on the whole walk back to the school, everybody was like, oh, you got beat up by a girl. You got beat up by a girl. It was embarrassing as hell, bro. I just felt like I didn't want to go to school no more, because I already know. You know what I'm saying? The word is going to spread fast. I already know everybody going to be telling everybody, oh, Elijah got beat up by a girl. And then all the girls like, you got beat up by a girl. And it was just embarrassing, bro. It was just an embarrassing experience getting beat up by a girl, bro. What? Now, yeah, she big. She she built like a quarter pounder cheeseburger. You know what I'm saying? She built like Rakishi. You feel me? She probably was Rakishi. You know what I'm saying? It was a couple years ago. Probably was her when she, got, when she was younger. She probably got older now. Went to the WWE. Oh, it probably was Rakishi. Yeah, that's what happened, man. I got spanked by a fat girl, bro. Unforgettable experience, you know what I'm saying? Shorty really tackled me. Got on top of me, so I pounded my face in. I tried to kick her. She wouldn't move. Like, it was just crazy. At least, you know, at least I fought. In life, guys, it don't matter about if you get beat up because you can't beat everybody. It matters about whether you fight back or not. Now, if you don't fight back, then that's a problem. You feel me? 
But you know, I gave him my all, I gave him my everything, man. I was a little scrawny kid, god damn. I was like 60 pounds soaking wet, you feel me? I had no muscles or nothing, god damn. You feel me? My balls ain't even dropping yet, nothing. So it's not an L all the way, but it's still a big L because I got beat up by a girl. But like I said, she was big, she was fat. What could you do? You probably got spanked by her too. But that was that story time, man. Extremely embarrassing, man. I hope you guys enjoyed that story time. If you did and if you want more, make sure you smash the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Turn on the post notification bell so you never miss an upload. Go subscribe to my vlog channel. Link will be in the description. Go follow my Instagram at Eli underscore so underscore crazy. And I'm going to see you guys in the next one, man. Don't be getting beat up by girls, man. I'm telling you, man. You feel me? Peace.